Hello friends, welcome to Electronic Circuit Hub. So today we are going to learn about how to add volt speed silicon carbide that is well known by SIC silicon carbide MOSFET in Altispice library. Okay, so today we will understand how to add C3 M001612 0K to Altispice. Okay, so this is basically a silicon carbide MOSFET. Okay, so C3 M001620 K is most commonly used silicon carbide MOSFET for higher power and higher switching application. Okay, so let us I'll, I'll tell you only three steps. If you follow these three steps, you can see here, you will be able to add your volt speed SI, SIC MOSFET in, in your Altispice library. So this is very easy, guys. You need to follow only three steps. If you follow those three steps, you can very easily add your volt speed silicon carbide mosfet in your lt spice okay so before i before i start explaining those three steps let us understand what is the sic mosfet what are what are the parameters for c3m0016120 so you can see at this moment i don't have any sic mosfet okay if i, I try to search it here c3 m double zero okay you can see here i don't have any part here right so so let us understand how you can add sic mosfet in your alt spice so let us first go through what is the c3 m0016120 k let us understand the parameters okay so as i told that this is silicon carbide power mosfet okay this is silicon carbide power mosfet and it, it it is used in high power high high frequency switching application so you can see here it is used in solar inverters ev motor driver high voltage dc dc converters and switch mode power supply okay so let us let us understand about C3M001620K. So if you if you look at the basic three parameters, so gay, you can see here VDS drain to source voltage is 1200 volt, IDI 25 degrees 115 amps, and RDS on is 16 milliohm. So you can see here, guys, the RDS on for this device is very low because it is made with the SIC technology, okay? So this is basically a C3M MOSFET and N-channel enhancement type MOSFET. You can see here, this is N-channel enhancement type of MOSFET and this is third generation SIC MOSFET, okay? And one more important thing you can see here, guys, you can see the 8 mm right 8 mm creepage distance between drain and source which is very important you not need to put any slot in your pcb because this distance 8 mm is very enough okay and it has high blocking voltage with low on resistance high speed switching with low capacitance fast intrinsic diode with low reverse recovery tr and you can see here this is four pin device okay it's not three pin it's a four pin drain and two source pin and one gate pin and if you look at this symbol okay you can see here this is gate pin number four is gate and you can see pin number one is drain tab okay this pin number one is drain and this also tab is also right right drain and you can see for source in sic mosfet they have given two they have given what they have given two two pins one pin is one this pin pin number three will be connected to the your driver and this is this will be connected to your right ground our system ground this will be connected to your driver ground right now let us understand how will you add the, the how will you add this mosfet in sic mosfet in your ltis device okay so you first you need to 
download the google drive file from description so go at the description of this video and you can you can easily download the google drive file okay so so you can see you have this is data sheet guys so you have only two files dot live file and this is like symbol file so you need to what is the step number two you need to put dot live file c user del documents lt spice and you can leave and sub so let me copy this file leave file and let me paste this file into lt spice 4 so it's you can see it's in live documents my documents and lt spice 4 go at this live lib and you can paste in here in this folder this is subfolder so leave file you can dot leave file you can for paste in the subfolder right and go it back and let me copy this symbol file and and this file you can paste in subfolder okay not sub in sim folder symbol folder sorry so i paste in the symbol folder so you need to refresh or restart your lt spice okay this this folder and now you can go in the component and you can see here guys this is nmos to 247 4l so you can see here guys this is your what now you can see this is your sic mosfet c3 m0016 120k you, okay you can see now the symbol it is it is in your library so hope guys you have understood how will you add the sic mosfet in your lt spice file lt spice library okay so you need to follow this three step first step is download the google drive file from description given in this video and second step is place the leave file in the subfolder and place the dot assembly file in sim folder okay so you need to place leave file dot leave file in subfolder dot s by file in sim folder then after placing this you have to restart your lt spice again so thanks for watching this video if you have any further question feel free to ask me in comment section thank you